hello again everyone now we'll talk more details about coupled and other programs that can be used in multiple sequence alignment in coupled it can be found easily in ncbi you can download your um, uh, your sequences and of course paste it in coupled coupled uh, is a very good and strong program and and also can align and produce multiple sequence alignment that is fairly accurate and of course this is embedded with uh, msa viewer and um, msav that's what they call it you can find in the top here the, on the top of the result and this uh, msav or uh, msa viewer you can see uh, many uh, uh, you, you can get, get a lot of information from your alignment also the msa viewer can calculate the phylogenetic tree for you uh, if you just even uh, put the mouse over the the, the the top bar you can get even what is the position of this uh, of the nucleotide uh, in the sequence and also the position of the nucleotide in the alignment of course you can enlarge and see uh, this in more details uh, if you just enlarge the view from this part also you can see the alignment parameters in that we will come later to the MSA viewer uh, in the next lecture anyway so so you can get your alignment multiple sequence alignment in uh, in the FASTA format or or even uh, other format you can align uh, your sequence so coupled is a very good program uh, that can be used for aligning uh, your protein sequences cluster omega is another one cluster omega can be found easily in epi cluster omega is uh, as we said is you can choose dna or, 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 or protein to align you can just post paste your sequence and then submit and you can get your result you can color your result you can download the file and also you can get file directory if you want based on the multiple sequence alignment the third one is tea coffee tea coffee is more accurate it has a uh, a lot of uh, a lot of program inside it uh, which can be used and uh, where well, and with different flavors so you can do uh, rna there's some specialized for dna some specialized for protein some specialized for rna so uh, you can use a uh, tea coffee uh, or m m coffee depending on what you are looking for uh, tea coffee and m coffee usually align it can work with dna rna or protein using uh, default parameters so uh, and uh, for rna alignment for example you can use uh, r coffee and sara coffee and both of them are different one of them align rna sequences using predicted second structure the second can align rna sequence using tertiary structure but both of them are specialized only for rna uh, a protein alignment protein alignment uh, uh, there is many flavors in tea coffee that can be used uh, for protein alignment. Uh, for example, Expresso can uh, align uh, protein sequence using structure formation. Uh, also, you can PSI coffee align distantly related protein using homology extension. So that's why uh, if you have a problem with your uh, sequences, uh, which is uh, could be distantly related or something, just you can use PSI coffee. You can overcome the problem of distant protein. Uh, TM coffee is specialized for transmembrane proteins. So, uh, and, and so if you have a transmembrane protein and you're work, working working with this type of proteins, so TM coffee is the good option uh, for you. Pro coffee actually for DNA for the aligned re homologous promoter region. So it work only in the promoter region. Uh, uh, so aligning them and extract good information from them can be done with pro coffee. Uh, accurate is combined most accurate modes of for uh, DNA, RNA, and protein. And combine is a very good uh, one that can be used for uh, combining two or more multiple sequence alignment into a single one. So you can easily, if you have two or more multiple sequence alignment, you made them by other programs, for example, or even you made them uh, by T coffee. You can simply combine these two or more uh, multiple sequence alignment files uh, uh, in combine evaluation there is many uh, ways to evaluate your uh, uh, your uh, multiple sequence alignment uh, using t coffee simply there is a core to evaluate your alignment output and uh, a program called irmsd uh, slash 
A, B, G, B. It's another one also. And uh, T, R, M, S, E, D. It's allowed uh, this also uh, can uh, uh, evaluate your uh, uh, sequence and strike of course can evaluate your protein in the multiple sequence uh, alignment uh, in single 3d structure uh, advanced there's many advanced option actually you can change uh, the advanced options beyond this lecture so uh, and and simply you can get your lecture and you can get your result and see uh, the result of your alignment easily by colorful way so uh, and there is a colorful scheme here color scheme here that can help you to interpret and uh, and help you to to see the conserved the more, most conserved places the most uh, aligned places and other places that is not uh, fairly aligned uh, uh, with TCAF. there is useful many useful link and mirror sites for TCAF. so uh, you can take a look at uh, the website and you can see uh, that it's, it's a very uh, important uh, tool that can be used in bioinformatics. Uh, of course, if you have a large set of, the, uh, of uh, data of uh, sequences, there is a program for that, which is uh, Muscle. Muscle is a very strong program. As we said before, you can find it in, in the official website of Muscle, which is Drive 5, and you can, you can find it also you can find muscle also in the EBI uh, MDL website. So uh, you can just uh, crunch your if you have several hundred of sequences, and you can you would, would like to have a very strong program that can deal with uh, this number of sequences. You simply can use muscle. Muscle uh, can be used uh, can be found easily as we said in MDL EBI website, and you just it's, it's a matter of pasting your sequence. Uh, copy and paste your sequence uh, in the website and then it will give you it will take maybe a little bit of time but it will after that will give you the results that can be used in other uh, if you would like to see it with other viewer or something multiple sequence alignment viewer or something in your own time you can see pick up your sequences set of sequences and try to find the differences between this uh, this four uh, programs you can you can see uh, the difference in time, the difference in coloring, the difference in, the, in information that they can produce, which one is better for you, which one is really good for your experiment, and which one uh, you can get uh, more information from. Thank you, and let's go to the next lecture.